What's up world, it's Dallas with Gadget Hacks, and today I'm going to show you how to clean up the WhatsApp interface just a little bit. If you're one of the millions of people who use the WhatsApp service for messaging, you've probably noticed that they keep sneaking in buttons that clutter up the message screen. There's two of these buttons now, a quick camera link and a microphone button that allows you to send voice messages. But for the most part, you can accomplish almost these exact same tasks by hitting the attachment button at the top of the message screen. So if you don't find yourself using these new buttons, or if you just prefer to keep things tidy, there's a quick and easy fix for these if you're rooted. You'll also need to have the exposed framework installed, but that's not hard to do at all. And I've got guides for knocking out both of those prerequisites linked out at the full tutorial for this one. And you can find that at the link in the description below this video. Basically, any questions you may have, they're probably all answered at the full tutorial, so be sure to check that out. So with that all out of the way, all you really need to do is install an exposed module. It's called WhatsApp Mods, so head to the download section of your exposed installer app and search it by name. Tap the top result, then swipe over to the versions tab and hit the download button on the most recent entry. Give it a few seconds and the installer should come right up. Just hit install for now, then when that's finished, you'll get a notification from Exposed that lets you know that the module isn't activated yet and a reboot is needed. So tap Activate and Reboot and all that stuff will be taken care of automatically. Alright, so now that you're back up, you can just open WhatsApp and you'll see the changes as soon as you jump into a message thread. Both of those redundant buttons are now gone and the screen looks nice and clean as a result. But say you didn't want both of the buttons to go away. Maybe one of them is actually useful to you. Well, you can open the WhatsApp Mods app and choose what combination of buttons you'd like to show or hide. You won't find the module's companion app in your app drawer, but it's easy enough to get to. Just open your exposed installer app and head to the Modules section. Here just tap WhatsApp Mods and you'll be taken to the interface. There's not much in here really, but you can choose what buttons to hide. As you've already seen, it hides both buttons by default, but if you want one of them to come back, just untick the corresponding box. There's also an entry for enabling debugging options, but I can't seem to get that one to work. But the changes occur on the fly, so all you have to do is re-enter the message thread over in WhatsApp to get your button back. Pretty cool, right? But like I said, be sure to check out my article over on GadgetHacks.com. And as always, we'd appreciate it if you would like and comment on this video and subscribe to our channel. So we'll see you again next time, folks, but until then, happy gadget hacking!